and sell them for us. Well, we've already got them sold. How do you get them into the UK without paying that? I'm on live, mate. Come on, bro. Do you know what I mean? Don't be asking me them questions when I'm on live. <laughs> Everyone double tap the screen. <clears throat> Right, drop game. All right, fuck it. See if there's anyone in here to drop game. You can't send them in the boxes, G. I know. I know. Right, fuck it. Let's see. Your Green Daytona was 120k at one point. I think they will hit that again. Yeah, no, I think I'm I'm hoping that the Green Daytona hits like 120, 125 in like January, February. I bought it for 66. Um, but I got to be fair, it was it was offered to me at 75 and I did a little promo to take 9k off. I wore um this guy's hat in my music video and he took 9k off it. So I got it for 66k which is an absolute steal. I could sell it now for fucking 80K, easy, 75K, easy. But yeah, I'm hoping it goes to like 120. Um, it's retailing at 80K. Yeah, yeah, exactly, that's what I'm saying. So I bought it for 66. I can I could sell it now for a profit. I, I know it ain't gonna go lower than 66, do you know what I mean? So I can sit there with this watch and, do you know what I mean? gets to 120 I've doubled my fucking money bruv it's crazy absolutely crazy right let's get some things in see if there's any any other all right let's go Sarah main account got banned again yeah for fuck's sake it's so jarring it is so jarring you get 100 105 max yeah well fairs do you know what I mean it's still a good it's still a good it's still 50% isn't it if I sell it for 100k I've made 50% in a few months on 60k down, 66k down, which is pretty mad, do you know what I mean? Pretty fucking mad. Uh, you're gonna be hiring for the marketing agency. Do you know what? I do actually want to fucking, I do want a few staff, bruv. When I start doing YouTube properly out here, I do actually want a few staff, bruv. <clears throat> What's happening with your nightclub? Nothing's happening with it at the minute. Opening up next year. Um, me and D are gonna do some other shit out there as well. I might, if if I can make enough money by um, by next, like next, well, realistically by February um, when they're all broke out there because they've not been in season for months. Like that's the thing with business, you gotta hit people when they're low, right? So say you tried to buy uh, new pieces in mind, Patek. No, I can't afford a Patek, mate. Well, like not, do you know what I mean? Even even a five nine eighty is like one ten, one twenty bags. I can't afford it, bruv. Like I, I bought that Daytona because it's gonna make me money. I, I'm not gonna buy something that ain't gonna make me money. Do you know what I mean? I don't have that much money to be able to do that. Um, but talking about the club, um, yeah, you want to hit people when they're low, and you want to offer them when they need. It's like a Rolex, yeah. You could buy a Rolex off. Say someone buys a Rolex and they run out of money and they really need money. You can buy it really cheap off them, right? Because they need money. Well, it's the same with like a club. It's the same with a car. It's the same with a house. Like if someone's skin, for example, club owners in the off season, they've not sold any drinks. They've and they've not sold anything. Sorry, in months, they're, they've got no money. They're living off what they made in the summer, etc. That's when you go into them and you say, right, I'll buy this for this. So maybe in like January and that, um, me and D are gonna go, right, yeah, um, I wanna buy another club out there. My, my plan is to buy up the whole of fucking Malia eventually, but that's a bit long. Like, so that's a long-term goal. Don't you think they plan for that? Nah, mate, they don't trust. They don't, bruv. They don't because we um, we got a deal, mate, and we, we will get a deal, trust. That's like, just if you got money, you got money. If you don't have money, you don't have money. 
cheap business deals, exactly. Right, I'm trying to get some things in it, but none are fucking accepting, I'll be real. Let's go, Joanna. Where's Ed? In the UK, doing stuff with Clark for his music video. I, I had him a flight, bruv, to come here, and he missed it because he's got his music video stuff to do. So, it's not my fault. Best rear delt exercise. Um, um, who's Amber to RXA? Gym live later, yeah. For sure, 100% I'll be going. It's just annoying to go live on this fucking account, bro. I'd rather go live on my main. But yeah, I will be going live. Um, best rear delt exercise, probably the cable crossover where you go like this. I don't really like face pulls. I don't really like the dumbbell ones. So probably, I don't even train rear delts, I'll be honest. But my, my shoulders are wham. I just hit high rows, to be honest. Gym lives are the best, man. Everyone's saying that. What venture made you the most money so far? Without a doubt, my training programs. Without a doubt, my training programs. Like, not even tr the training app that I now have, which is like the monthly payment thing. The most amount of money I ever made was training programs. And the period where I was making the most amount of money was when I was stacking to buy the Lambo. Um, that was, that was just a joke. That was a joke. And you wouldn't even believe it. I told you the sort of dough that was coming in off them programs, bruv. Like, I don't, every, every, every sort of person, young person in the gym must know someone who's bought a program off me. There's that many that were flying out, bruv. <laughs> Head fitness plan, use discount M4. Yes, code M4, yeah. I wish I took a screenshot of it, bruv, because it was up for, Code M4 was up for uh, maybe three, four weeks, and it was just fucking, like, it was a joke. It was an absolute joke, mate. But yeah, it was crazy. Tell us, mate. No, I'm not gonna say, there's too many men in it. There was, like, back in the old days when there was 50 people in the live, I would say in it, I'm not going to say how much dough was coming in, but just, just know it was fucking crazy. But the, even the training app now in Dubai is, is flying out, but n not the same as training programs, because obviously the training app's monthly, so you have to be more, like, actually seriously committed to it, because when you have a subscription thing, people are more like, oh, it's, like, it's a subscription, which is rightly fair enough. Um, but, but, yeah... The training app's just better though. I'd rather be selling a training app where it's customized to everyone and I can say that on live and I can be confident that it's the best fitness advice, protocol, teaching method that I can put out there. The training programs, it was the best thing to make money, but it wasn't the top. It was, it was eight out of 10 for getting you into, no, like 7.5 out of 10 for actually getting you into shape because it's not customized to everyone. Whereas the training app that I sell is 10 out of 10 for getting you into shape. It's literally better than having a personal trainer because it's all my information, all my, all my fitness advice, just put in one thing. Everyone's saying Bunzu, I'm in Dubai. You guys off your head. What size earring? I'm not sure, but my man got it for me for my 21st. It's a real diamond, so. You know how we do over here, B. No fake diamonds in my ears, B. You know I'll be glistening, B. Come on, B. Well, yeah, guess in the chat, I've got a with a seriously big fitness influencer out here. Guess in the chat. Guess in the chat who it is. You should do a ladies' plan. Mate, the, 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 this is, the training app is for girls and boys, mate. It's all customised for you. Guess in the chat. A seriously big fitness influencer. I'm training with him in a few days. Yeah, RJ, RJ guessed it right. That's all I'm saying, I'm not even gonna give it away. What's the fitness app called? Go on the app store and type in Head Fitness. H-E-D Fitness, that's the app. It's for girls and for boys. Anyone in here can go check it out now. But yeah, you man, I've got a seriously big collab coming up. Right, listen, I'm gonna go have a shower and then I'm gonna go eat breakfast and um, 
I'm gonna go to the gym, all right? So it was really nice chatting to you guys this morning. It was really, really nice, all right? I'm gonna be live in a bit. I need to go get a trim and shit as well. So yeah, I'll see you, man, in a bit. See you later, lads.